Introducing first, our first competitor was born into the sport of arm wrestling. With both parents as pros, the sport courses through his veins. Standing at a towering six feet three inches tall, this landscaper weighs in tonight at 170 pounds from England. He is Tom the Machine Holland. And his opponent, this Latvian is a multi-hammer holder, a cornerstone of the lightweight division, capturing the prestigious lightweight titles in 2014, 15, and 17. Recognized around the globe as among the top lightweight competitors in the world, he stands at 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighs 169 pounds, he is the Jedi, Giannis Amoli. Ah. So the Jedi makes his way in. 20 years he's been pulling and arm wrestling competitively around the world, as you touched on. Mentioned his break, so to speak. Tom Holland hasn't pulled a lot either, though, really, in yeah. the last few months. You know what? Tom's been dealing with an injury, uh, but he's coming in focused, and he's telling me he's feeling great. Giannis ah! took some time off. Giannis, a little bit to of the family, table. a little bit of life, but now Set he's back and hungry again and wants to reclaim shoulders. his throne. So this one is, this one could be a lot of fireworks early. Look at this. Yes. Square up. Square up. Open hand. a three-time hammer holder in his here. days in the WAL. And I got to note, they've never Close pulled each other yes. in competition. Stay right here. Yep. Do not cover the thumb knuckle. So we don't know what to expect, literally. We really don't. Straight, straight wrist. Sit back Close and enjoy your hands. it. Go! Oh, it's off early. Giannis with position. Giannis is holding him. Thomas feeling it out. Oh, oh, Giannis gets a little bit higher in his hand. Almost. He gets the finish. He, he gets did. the finish. One nothing lead for Giannis Avalins. He got Tom out of position early there. He got Tom out of position early and capitalized in it. But in Tom's, if I'm in Tom's corner, I'm telling him, get to the strap. Get so to the strap here, Max. Giannis took his hand, and Tom stayed in it. He didn't try to let go. He didn't try to, you know, do anything crazy, but. I think he's got to make an adjustment and get to the straps because it could be a different game for him there. Yeah. Certainly agree with you on that. Both men in their corners. Tom Holland has Justin Bishop in his corner. And uh, Giannis has got the Latvian crew behind him. <laughs> his buddies that he trains with, Coach Ray and yep. Vladislavs. And Giannis is getting fired up. Yeah. I remember the first time I saw him, my first year being a part of this back in 2015. And I said to Neil, who we were, at that time we were doing the shows together, I said, who is this guy? Just a, he's a fascinating arm wrestler. I love watching him compete. Yeah, he's very cerebral, you know. He stays, he stays to his game, he stays to his skill set, and he dominates using it. About 30 seconds. But I think Tom is still in this match. One adjustment away seconds. from taking control of it if he can get to his spot, which is the hook. He's a freakishly strong inside puller. He just needs the match to go there, Ben. That's exactly what yep. he needs. We saw Tom Holland in, in Atlanta and at 4.06 last year. He went against Jamie Sheldon and Jeff Hale. That was in the uh, Battle Royale yeah. format. You were in that, weren't yeah, you? Yeah, I might have been participating in it. <laughs> anyway, hey, gentlemen, to the table. And Tom hooked everyone there, including yeah. Jeff Which Hale. He was pinning everyone. So if this goes to a hook, it's Tom's world. Down. And he just needs to do something, anything, to get it there. Square up, Tom. 1 0 lead for Giannis Samlins. Here we go. And it's in the second pull of this way. best of five. Hey, you got to bring this down so I can get you to the middle. I think Justin Bishop gave Tom some good advice in the corner. No, no pressure. Because no I'm pressure, seeing no a little pressure. bit of an adjustment right here from Tom Close in the yourself. setup. Stay Which right was, here, gentlemen. he's Close looking at back nope. pressure more and be more up with Giannis right there so he doesn't uh -huh. lose his hand. Gotcha. I got one See on that? Giannis he doesn't want his hand and wrist to be compromised. Mr. Giannis. And he's got leverage. So if he keeps his hand, 30 seconds. We're going to he the can strap. dictate the match. Yep. You heard Bart Wood there. 30 seconds have elapsed, so that means the strap okay. is applied, the palm, and this is going to help Holland. No this is going to help him because he can set a hook using the strap, 
And if he sets that hook, Higher he level. can really take control of this match. Mentioned some of the credentials yep. that Giannis has. And Tom Holland from a family of pro arm wrestlers, both his dad and his mother were both yeah. world champs. Sure his Started in 2007 at just 15 years old. Yeah, I'm going to hold you, what, you here while I crank down. No, I'm, I'm, I'm just cranking. He's not, mm -hmm. nothing's going to start. Okay. <clears throat> okay. No pressure in the middle. In the middle. We have a Bart foul Wood count. continues to get zero. them adjusted. Giannis. Close your thumbs. Straight. Close your hands. Go. There it is. You the hook is set. The hook is set. And look at Holland. Look at Holland's confidence. I told you, Ben. Look yes, at the confidence you did. from Tom Holland. He does not believe he can be beat there. He does not believe his arm will go down there. And now he's bleeding him. Now he's waiting him, Ben. Yes. Now, he's, now he goes for it. No pin, but he's comfortable. And Giannis says, okay, let's play in there. Giannis is trying to come up with something, but he's deep. He's trying deep to dig inside. In. Oh, yeah. Tom's got him right where he wants him. And Tom's, Tom's waiting him out. Tom could finish here, but he wants Giannis to burn his pronator and burn his hand out. Ooh, big hit, no pin. But look at Giannis Coming with the press. Giannis Coming with back. the press. Winner. Unbelievable. What a win. Unbelievable by Giannis. Two nothing well, lead. Be, yeah, that's wow. how can you not respect that man? Oh. That is so that's awesome. world class right there. It was there, before the match was in the setup. It that's was in so the setup. It wasn't My during goodness. the match. You understand it was in the setup. If if it would if after I said go, if I would have called an elbow foul, then he would have been on the runner and we would have had a rematch. It was in the setup. Okay. You're and I think Tom is saying, you know, what, what, what about that pin? It was yeah, yeah. a close moment there. Yeah, it was real close. Okay. He had a question. He's always smiling, isn't he? Yeah. yeah. Here's a look back it at it, Max. Setup. It wasn't after and now you just go, see what so Giannis did was he put his shoulder behind it and then he pressed side and down using his tricep and his shoulder to secure <laughs> that pin. I love it. And we got nice ourselves a match now, folks. Yep. 90 seconds in between pulls. There's Giannis Amelins with his crew. Justin Bishop working the corner of Tom Holland. So what can Holland come back? Does he come back with the same thing? Just hope it works this time? What's he do? He needs a slight adjustment. Giannis is just a master of technical ability at the table, so... Tom had the power there. It looked like he had the position to finish, but was just Coming unable to do seconds. so. He just needs to change that angle so that when he hits, he hits close enough to the pad to finish this time. That's, that's what he has to do. All right, so both men will be Get set here table. for this third pull in this match. Giannis Amelin's already at the table. Holland comes back in. Giannis trying to make it a clean sweep for the second right. straight match, as Bishop it. did against Celieris in our first match of the night. Okay, open up. Square up to the table. I, I don't want to horse you around, but I got to get you right there. Okay, not in the middle yet. Close your thumbs. I'm going to bring you over. Right there. Yep, look. come around, come around. Come around right here. Close your hands. Nope, offsetting both knuckles. Both knuckles, I gotta see the knuckles. 30 seconds on the clock, we're going to the strap. Indeed. You said before, this favors Holland, the strap here. Yeah, and uh, you saw him, him get what he on wanted the to in he the did. second round. He got the hook, he set right. the hook. But Giannis, give him some credit. Mm -hmm. he, his hand backed up his, or his arm backed up his hand. Just as strong, took Holland's hits, absorbed them, gained position, put the press in, finished. So, like I said, Tom's got to hit him to his side of the table and gain a better position to be able to finish him. Very good. Jen Wood helping out there. Strap okay. applied to the hands and wrists of Giannis Amelins and Tom Holland. Yeah, Giannis just presents so much intelligence and experience at that table. It, it, you know, it's hard to get around him Giannis, because gotta he's go got the power to back side. it up as well. Come over a little bit. I mean, you might have to lower Giannis you trying to go for the clean sweep here. But he's got to come to your. You got to go your way in the middle. 
not loading with him. Do I go this way? No, no back. Close your thumbs. Supination. Right here. Supination. Right here. Turn it around. Close your hands. Go. Oh. Okay. Okay. It's deep. It's deep in the center. It is dead center. It is dead center right now, Ben. Giannis looking comfortable. Looks he like is. he stopped him there. He is. But he can't pull through him yet. Tom holding on. Just holding on with brute elbow strength. All joint there for Tom. He's refusing to quit. I love it. Yeah. But Giannis is gaining leverage and gaining position. Yes. And Giannis puts the shoulder in. Giannis presses him for the third round in victory. So two matches and both have been three nothing victories. First Justin Bishop, now Giannis Amelin as he defeats the very gracious Tom Holland. Two great competitors in the first time these two men have ever competed, Max. A lot of mutual respect there. Yeah. And, uh, you know, Tom was the slight underdog coming in just because of who Giannis is. And Giannis proved, hey, I've been, I've been in the be best top two or three lightweights in the world for 10 years, and I don't plan on leaving that spot. That's right. Here's a look back at the final moments from the pen. Textbook. Textbook shoulder press. Textbook adjustments. I mean, you want to study technical arm wrestling, study Giannis and Mullins. Good stuff. Gets the win. And the reaction is he takes it 3 0. And he's standing by down in the pit with our own Jason Zone Fisher. Jason. Giannis, you are one of the most experienced arm wrestlers in the world. You've won at every level. But it's been a long time since you were on a WAL stage. Be honest, were you a little nervous before this match tonight? <laughs> I, still, I still am. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> You know, you know uh, two years out of international arm wrestling. Uh, I have more than 20 years experience, but still uh, it's put more pressure on me, so. Well, how do you feel about your return to the WAL stage? It couldn't have gone much better. A 3-0 win over Tom Holland tonight. Yeah, 3-0. What else you can move? Yeah. That's it, yeah. But, uh... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now, in that second round, it looked like Tom was pretty confident that he had you pinned. He had you in a difficult position, but you never gave up. I mean, really, what was going through your mind when he was shaking his head no, that he, he looked like he had you? Uh, I felt slow. I felt strong, but slow today. I was, uh, I think, losing every start, and, and Tom getting his position, but uh, I was prepared for this match. I know what he's doing, and uh, I know that he's... Uh, good in this position, so I have to find the way out of this. So at this point in your career, what else do you have to prove to yourself and to the world? Where is my hammer? I'm looking forward for my fourth hammer. <laughs> I have three in a home, so <laughs> All right. I want another one. He wants number four. Well, congratulations. That was great. Is there anyone in particular you're gunning for? You've been studying tape. You've been looking at the WAL for a while. Is there anyone out there that you want to call out? Uh, same names we are hearing around all, all day. Uh, Jeff Hale, Sam Harris, Tony Kritowski. So uh, Jeff Hale, I, I have zero one against him, so I want at least make this uh, result better. Sam Harris, same. Well, Tony this Kritowski. lightweight division is exciting. There are so many great competitors, and you are in that group for sure. Congratulations on an amazing win here tonight. Thank you, thank you, crowd. It's it's pleasure to be here. I'm enjoying very much, and thank you, my team here and my team in Latvia. Stay strong, stay strong, and love arm wrestling.